instructional videos. Today, we are putting together the showgoer backlit counter. So to begin, I'm going to remove all the pieces from this convenient carry case. The first thing I like to do is connect together the base of the display. So the base will be the board with the power box, and the front of the display will have a hook and loop strip. So the first thing you want to do is make sure the one side is aligned so the power cord is through the little notch. And then you're just going to lay out the other side with the short piece. And then using the long poles, you're going to connect together the base using the pole and the corner piece. When it comes to the corner connectors, you want to make sure that both of the connecting grooves are facing on the outside. Now when connecting your pieces together, you want to make sure the groove on the piece, the flush side is facing out. There is a shorter groove on all the black bars and that piece needs to be in, facing in or facing down. So you want to make sure when you are attaching the pieces that they are completely slid together. So once you have your first corner hub attached, you're just going to keep working your way around the display, connect, using the connectors to connect the pieces together. So once you have your base connected, the white bottom piece should easily just slide right on the top and it just sits on the grooves. And then adjust the power cord as needed to make sure it aligns in the grooves. Now that I have my power cord adjusted, we're going to start building up the display. So the next thing you're going to do is attach the four corner pieces, which are the shorter poles. So you're just going to slide them onto each connector. Now that I have all my pieces attached, the next thing I'm going to do is connect the top together. So just like you did the bottom, you're going to use the connectors and the remaining bars. And you want to make sure that the groove side is facing out. So you're just going to slide in all the connectors and then I'll attach the pieces. Now that I have all my corners attached, I'm going to connect the two short sides and then the long sides. So when connecting these pieces, you want to make sure that the groove that is set in a little bit is facing the inside because that's where the tabletop is going to sit. So once you have the one side attached, you're going to attach the other side. Now that I have my frame of the display put together, I'm going to attach the lights. So I'm just going to unroll the lights and you're going to use the hook and loop strips to attach them. So I'm just going to unroll them and then you're going to set the top bar onto the little indents on the top. And then you're just going to align it on the bottom and push down the hook and loop strip. Now that I have my lights attached, the next thing I'm going to do is connect to the power source. So you're just going to align the two cables and then screw them together. The backlit counter does not have an on and off switch. It is controlled by plugging it in and out of an outlet. So now that I have my lights all attached, the next thing I'm going to do is put the top on. And you're just going to set it on top. I like to set it shiny side up. Now that I have my top attached, it's time to attach the graphics. So I am going to start with a side graphic and then work my way around. So the trick with the graphics is to start in the one corner and push the gaskets into the corner. So when attaching the gaskets, you're going to start one corner, then you're going to work to the opposite corner and then attach the two top ones. And then for attaching the graphic, you want to work opposite sides. So you want to push in on one side and then push in on the other. It's easier to go work side to side than it is to just run your fingers all the way up it. Once you have your graphics all attached, the last thing you're going to do is plug it into a standard outlet. It is just that easy to set up your showgoer backlit counter.